hope it happens. So E311 could get a green makeover. Yes, you guys, you heard it right. E311 could get a green makeover. Now, the Dubai Green Spine Project is a part of Dubai 2040 Urban Master Plan to make Dubai a 20-minute city. So in this project, which is proposed from firm uh, development firm URB, they said, let's look at Sheikh Mohammed bin Zayed Road, the E311, but let's make it green to a phenomenal expense. They said they could pull on electric trams, cycling, pedestrian routes, 100% solar powered trams, and they proposed adding 1 million new trees. Now, the project will be a 64 kilometers long sustainable corridor with energy efficient buildings and a real time traffic management system. It is not yet confirmed, you guys, but a grant, of course, you know, I would say. Let's manifest it. Let's manifest it. Like the photos definitely went viral yesterday. It was one of the big stories that broke in Dubai yesterday evening. And it's kind of being like, if we could do anything to this city, I think the developers are saying, what would we do to make this city to take it to another level? Not that it needs it, in all fairness. And I think they're saying, let's make it green. One million trees. But you have to ask like the realities of the cost um, and yeah. also the realities of like water to yeah. feed these trees. Like it's a nice image. But I would rather making sure that, you know, the trees don't need so much water because then it's costly to the environment. If they could do this without hurting the environment, I'm all in. I mean, I agree with you. But having Dubai be that, it's my dream. It's my dream, honestly. Because, like, you know, like, we are... Um, If you do not commute by a car or by the metro, you guys cannot really reach anywhere. And I have always dreamt of having Dubai look like that. I mean, that would be beautiful. True, but Dubai can't be everything. I know, but you never know. I want it to be everything. But I, I, th- and I, think, that, but I think that people are always like, it, it can be this. And I think that the, the leaders really will take on board everything that people ask for and say. And to become a pedestrian city, oh, yes. God. Oh, God. That would be amazing. Yes. But to become a green city, It just doesn't mm. feel like we even need to push that, right? Because it's it's already beautiful in what it is, which is it is a uh, beautiful skyline yes. and <sighs> desert, surrounded by desert. That is true. And Can it be is, everything else? I'm not sure. You never know. For example, like um, if you would want to say, for example, like there is Masdal City in Abu Dhabi, right? I've went to it. And let me tell you, It is beautiful. And I felt like, wow, I would want to live here. Mm, you know yeah. what I mean? And, and, and it's sustainable it's, city, it's greens, amazing, ranches, Alberari. Right? And you can even, by the way, like feel the difference. You know, when there are like less cars, people are walking and things are very close to you. I, I just would love that for like Dubai. If Dubai can get to that without having anything <laughs> done to the environment. Why not Dubai? You can do it, Dubai. I'm here. I'm rooting for you. You can do it. I mean, yeah, (laughs) all for the pedestrian city, for sure. Um, It just looks beautiful. I feel like the images are just kind of like an AI, like make Dubai green. (laughs) Make Dubai green. That's how it would look like. But I would be walking. I I would want to be like, oh, yeah, um, I'm walking to Dubai Mall. How amazing would that be? I mean, you could take the metro and, and take that. 5k route walking and it's covered. Um, let's jump into our next story. 